Hey y'all and welcome back to my channel. Sorry for the rough look, but it's actually been raining all here today. Here all day today, and so I figured I'd jump on here while I had a minute and make our newest video, which is a little bit different than some of the other videos I've done. And this one's going to be what is in my toddler's bag. My daughter actually just turned three in June. And so we decided it was time to get away, veer away from her diaper bag, and she would get or use her own big girl bag, backpack, whatever you want to call it. She is actually special needs, which I'm still trying to make that video explaining what's all going on with her. And so she's still, like, we're still potty training. We're still going to specialists, we're going to all of that, and so there's going to be some stuff in here like your toddler might need, or like you might want to put in there, this, but this is just a generic, like, what should we use, and I mean, obviously there's going to be some stuff that's not in here that I haven't put in here yet, like snacks, I don't put in there until the night before. And so those won't go in there till tomorrow night because we actually have an appointment Tuesday. And so without further ado, we'll just get on into this what's in my toddler's bag. So this is just a generic backpack. The pouch actually broke. And so what I do is I just keep a dry wash rag in here for like if she spits up or anything and I can wet it and just stick and just stick it in this front pocket and then I wanna get home I'll wash it. Then this it's just like a little she actually got this with from her PJs for fighter sponsor and this just has a little lip gloss in it so I stuck it on her bag. And so now we're gonna open her bag. And the first thing in here is her sensory monkey. I actually am doing like a review and a party on some parts from Cutainment. And this is actually one thing in here is a sensory monkey, which is a weighted monkey that helps her calm down and everything with the big sensory episode. And this has actually helped her because it has actually helped her calm down a lot. So this, has, he's going to start going on any kind of road trips we go with her. Next in here, so I have my stuff in here too, only because I don't take a purse when we go. I just find it easier to put everything for me and for her in her bag. So this is just like my feminine stuff, body lotion, like some lotion samples, toilet paper stuff, my pins, just all generic stuff. I don't want to fall in the bottom of her bag. Next thing in here is her wipes, which is just a travel thing of wipes. My wallet, which has like her insurance, my license, all of that for the doctors. This next thing, actually, I didn't know existed up until I went to HEV today. And these are a two pack. Two, I got two of these. Two two packs of pull up. And there's just two of them in here for the go. And these, I believe, were 98 cents a piece. So for about $2, I got her four pull ups. And these, I'm probably going to start getting just to keep in her bag said we are potty training. I'm letting her potty train at her own pace. So we're, these are going to come in handy. And she probably may not use all four of them, but whatever she does use, I'll replenish when I go back to the store. Next thing in here is she loves books, and so this is just her sh book, shape book. My, th my journal, which I keep all of her like medicine stuff we talked about the doctor and all of that in here and then if you've seen my organized video I keep like my life in this journal and then the like last thing that's in here right now is her folder now this folder actually has like her appointment notices all of her like therapy what she did in speech therapy and then like her diagnosis is her like post op for her ear surge, her eye surgery, and I mean just all bunch of stuff. And I mean this 
I mean, like he said, each child's going to be different, but I like to keep this in here so like they just don't fall to the bottom of her bag and they all keep straight. Like I said, I know, and then actually one more thing in here. She actually doesn't know who I got this for. This I got for the car ride to the, to temple to where we're going, and this just has four crayons, twenty five stickers, and a twenty four page fun size coloring book. And she's been really into coloring and stickers lately, so I figured this would be the perfect thing for on the way there or on the way back for her. And it was only a dollar, so I mean. I'll probably get her one of these for like each time we go on a specialist appointment so she has something to do in the car and she's not completely bored out of her skull. But in her snacks, like I said, we'll get put in here roughly, like I said, either of those. I'll do, I try to do it the night before or if I'm like just exhausted and want to go to bed. I will put them in there the morning of, and I'll also put her, or give her her cuppy that she uses. And see, it's just, because she's three, she doesn't have that much, but she does have a good amount. And that is it for what's in my toddler's bag. If you like this video, give please give it a big thumbs up, and I'll talk to y'all next time. Bye.